We have journeyed far and wide. Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I appreciate you stopping by. We're camped out at Whitney Lake, way up river at Kimball Bend. Since there's not much going on, it's cold and dreary, we decided to go check out some other campgrounds. So let's go check out Plowman Creek Campground. So Plowman Creek has been closed the last three times I've been to Whitney. It looks like it's open today. So let's go see some stuff at Plowman Creek. So Plowman Creek, the highlight of Plowman Creek. Well, they have a basketball goal, but the most important thing is they have a boat ramp. Now, if, if, if somebody knows the answer to this, I'd sure appreciate you posting it in the comments down below. Ah, that's what that's supposed to be. That's a life jacket tree. I've always wondered what these were. I, I thought maybe they were just a great big old bird roost for the turkey vultures, but that's where you're supposed to be able to find life jackets. So at one point, I think this was a access to the courtesy dock. I don't know. Doesn't serve too much of a purpose these days. Plowman Creek has got some really fantastic primitive campsites, and you, can, you can, I'll have a, I will have a driving tour of Plowman Creek Campground so that you can check it out. Uh, that'll show up on a on a Wednesday video. Meanwhile, let's go see if we can find some more stuff. So Plowman Creek campground it's a corps of engineer campground on whitney lake and plowman creek has some really nice now it, well i say really nice There's some pretty nice primitive sites now this is actually a water site little it, getting level will be a bit of a challenge because you're running this way but man check this out you're like right here on the water Perfect place to launch a, a kayak or a, a small watercraft or heck a big watercraft for that matter. And, and just, you're right here at camp. And they have a whole bunch of them. Check out the driving tour. That I, check out the driving tour that I did for Plowman Creek and you can see all of these fantastic campsites. All right, let's go see some more stuff at Plowman Creek. So if you're come, if you're gonna camp at Plowman Creek and you're and you're bringing the kiddos or the grand kiddos with you, you'd be happy to know that they do have a play structure, but it's rather removed. It's it's pretty far from the RV campsite. You got to get down here into this tent camping area. To the, you have to get into the primitive camping to find the play structure. But you know, you gotta you gotta keep them kiddos happy. So at least you can bring them down here to burn off some energy. All right, let's go find some more stuff. Plowman Creek Campground. This is a Corps of Engineer campground, in case I didn't, didn't mention that before. Not a whole lot of stuff here, but you'll be happy to know if you've got nothing else to do, you're, you're bored to tears and you need something to do, you can bring a basketball with you and maybe play basketball. You better make sure you're hitting the hoop every time though, cause the backboard is no more. <laughs> now there's, there's a gas line, or actually it's a petroleum pipeline that runs across the lake here. And just on the other side, you, you can kind of see maybe there's a white sign right there. Uh, part of a white sign part of it is missing it hasn't been maintained but it says don't anchor above this pipeline it's a petroleum pipeline you could get blowed up and that would be your claim to fame <laughs> plowman creek we're done here we've seen all there is to see there's some pretty campsites Easy access to the water, lots of bank access. There's an equestrian campground that currently appears to be used as a group campsite. Uh, I didn't see any horse trailers, but there were a whole lot of travel trailers. 
anyway we're done here at plowman creek we're gonna head on up the or head down the lake to steel creek and check out that campground it's also a coe park that i think is free camping well since we weren't so far away i mean we were just at plowman creek park well there's another park that shows up on google maps on whitney lake that's steel creek park uh, well we're this close we're just gonna go check it out this park does not show up on recreation.gov so i'm thinking that there's there's no reservable campsites here but there may be some dry camping opportunities so we're gonna go check out steel creek park u.s army corps of engineer campground whitney lake let's go to it let's go see some steel creek park stuff so if you're looking for some dry camping boondocking opportunities on whitney lake steel creek park just might be it for you look at this campsite this is if you don't have to have power how can you go wrong you can get pretty level right there with a an rv i can get trudy level there great big oak tree giving you shade somebody actually was hanging swings out of it i guess and left their trash let's go see the other side of this this is a neat little campground yappy's impressed i think i think this is this is where nomadic fanatic does his boondocking i think i could be wrong but a couple of these sites look like places he's he's shot videos from anyway we're gonna run over to the other side of steel creek park and check that out and we're gonna go visit the boat ramp let's go see some stuff steel creek park whitney lake there's a boat ramp for your boating pleasure Be a nice day to be out on the lake, nice and calm. Water's super clear today too. We're still on, I think it's the north side. We're still on the north side. Steel Creek Park is on a peninsula and we're on the north side of that peninsula. We're gonna head back over to the south side and show you a couple of campsites over there. There's some cool stuff there too. Let's go see some more stuff. Steel Creek Park, Whitney Lake far uh, to the to the best of my knowledge this is this is one of maybe two places on whitney lake where you can camp for free and they have two boat ramps and we've got this long jetty out here let's go check out the long jetty and then we've noticed that there are there are still a couple of sites available here at Steel Creek Park. This is uh, the Thanksgiving weekend 2021. This would be the perfect place to put bobber in the water. We have rain in the forecast today. I guess this must be the high water courtesy dock. Anyway, Steel Creek Park, Whitney Lake. It's one of the, actually one of the prettier parks on Whitney Lake. All right, let's let's go see some more stuff. Steel Creek Park, Whitney Lake. Not a whole lot to it, you know. Uh, it's just a great opportunity to do some free camping on Whitney Lake. Back here in front of the sign because 
there's not much else to show you. There's not even a dump station here. So the nearest dump station would be over at Plowman Creek. And if you have a recreation or a, a national parks card, you can get in there and dump for free. So, hey, I hope you guys have enjoyed our very brief visit to Steel Creek Park. Whitney Lake, if you have, please click on that thumbs up and bash me out across your social media. That really helps with the YouTube algorithm. And I would be so honored if this is your first visit, I would be so honored if you would consider clicking on the subscribe button. And for those of you who have been following along, I am most deeply honored. Thank you for that. That's why I do what I do. And for my patrons, you rock. All right, y'all come back now, you hear?